What's good YouTube, it's your boy Blake and today I'm back with another monthly pickups video. So today I'm just gonna be going over basically my sneaker pickups that I picked up throughout the whole last month. And before I get started, I just wanna throw it out there again that I have slowed down a little bit on sneaker collecting because I am going my own way. My parents will not be the plug anymore. Not saying that they've always been, but from now on it's just me guys. So. Just understand that as I'm going through my videos and especially these but I did pick up a few dope sneakers last month and I'm gonna go through each of them there's four pairs not too shabby I don't want to say it's been the best month but it's not the worst so let's start off with these the Air Jordan 1 Letterman's the quality on these is a one very 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 nice sneaker I do love this metallic on the back I think that was a great hint that Nike added along with the swoosh. Now the quality on this, I would say is about an eight out of 10, maybe high eight, low nine. It is not shattered backboard quality, but it is cyber one quality. These smell amazing. The leather is amazing. We do have that on air uh, insole inside. And these are pretty nice. These are vibrant, of course, but I love wearing these with jeans and the more that you wear a Jordan 1 like this, the softer the leather will become and just the nicer they'll be to have in your collection. So that's my first pickup of the month. Now the next pickup is the Adidas NMDs in the gray colorway. I did get these at 2020, a local sneaker store by my area in Sherman Oaks. This is my first NMD. A lot of you guys told me to get these and I got a pair and now I want more. Super comfortable, super light. Just very comfortable and fashionable, I guess you could say, because these do look very, very nice with a lot of my joggers. So I'm happy I got these. Leave a like down below for me getting these because a lot of you guys did tell me, since I'm always wearing 350s, to get a pair of these because these are comfortable and I'm not gonna ruin them and I won't be a hype beast. So yeah. Now the next sneaker I'm not gonna talk too much about. Just gonna show you guys them, say a few things, and then we'll move on to the last sneaker but this was my third pickup of the month. I'm sure many of you know what these are. These are the Yeezy 350 Pirate Blacks. These are size 10. I am a size 11, so I will not be able to fit into these, but maybe I'll throw these in that giveaway. I may just get a new uh, pair in the desired size that the winner selects for the giveaway, but more details coming on that. But you can't really ever have enough 350s, especially when you get for a good price. So. I snagged these and I picked them up. So that's all I'm gonna say about those. Now the last final favorite sneaker pickup of the month is the Kobe 11 Mamba Days. Now this is the default option and I think it's the best option. We do have that 413 and then the other one it just say Mamba Day, but I should have a review up for these. These are super dope. The only thing that sort of disappoints me is the amount of protection we have on the shoe. It almost sort of ruins that pattern that we're trying to see in the first place, but to get you guys a close up on that, we have it like the all along the midsole. And I guess it's not bad, but it sort of just ruins the, the print that they're trying to show in the first place. These are one of my favorite Kobe's that I have in my collection now. So yeah, I know this video is probably super short and super quick, but I'm trying to make a lot of videos for you guys. Let me know down below which sneaker you thought was the best pickup for me this month. Make sure to leave a like down below. Can we get this to 2,000 likes? Let's hit 2,000. I do these every month. Show some love to this video. Show some love to my old videos. I'll leave the links down below, but stay tuned for big, big things. This is a B sneak shirt, if you guys don't already know. I did sell these at Lace Locked and Loaded, and I will be at LA Sneaker Con along with a lot of other guys. I won't be with them, but I know a lot of people will be in the building with a lot of heat. So make sure to subscribe. A lot of vlogs coming because I know you guys love my vlogs and I did get a better vlog camera. I'll, I won't talk about that right now, but I will be selling these at SneakerCon. Let me know down below if you'll be there. Let me know down below if you'd actually want a B sneak or your own initial for the B because I didn't do it for the last show because I didn't know if I gave enough time to let you guys know in advance. But SneakerCon LA is June 25th and 26th. Hopefully I will have a table, not confirmed yet, but I will be there with Fedor and a few other friends. 
So make sure to leave a like down below if you haven't already, because I already told you to. It's your boy Blake, be sneak, and I'll see you guys next time. We out. Thank you.